Do you have any dented cans in your food storage? I just bought this one at Walmart and John noticed that, look, the bottom is crushed. So my question is, is this really safe to eat? And at the same time, a question that I've wondered is, are the new pop top lids as safe to use as regular? So today we have food scientist Joseph Bell who's going to answer all of those questions for us. Hey, Provident Preppers, I'm Jonathan. And I'm Kylene. And so do you have any cans of food in your food storage? And are they dented? Do you know what happens to food when a can is dented? Well, today we have Joseph Bell, who is a principal scientist, and he's worked in the food science industry for over 30 years. And now that he's retired, he has time to spend with me and be able to educate all of us on when our food is safe. So today we are going to talk about food safety when it comes to cans. So Joe, thanks for being with us. Teach us. Okay, so cans are a marvelous thing because they can give a good shelf life to your product. Um, the thing to watch on a can is the seam. There's obviously the, the seam at the top of the can and on the bottom of the can. This particular can is not a seam. That's really, uh, they molded it. So there's a seam here and a seam here, and there's a seam. Well, I guess on this one, there's not a seam on the side. There's only a seam at the top. Wherever the seam is, whether, for most cans, there's one on the, the bottom, the top and on the bottom, and one running from top to bottom. As long as the dent is not on a seam and the seam is intact, you're okay. If you can see that seam is a little bit stressed, you don't want to take a lot of risks with the seam. If when it, uh, you figure a seam is kind of uh, has been crimped kind of like this. And if the seam has been dented, then if uh, for just a microsecond, when it was dented, the seam can do this. It'll open and close. That could be enough in principle to allow a contaminant to get inside the can and you've now got a contaminated product inside there. If on the, the top or the bottom of the can, there's any bulging whatsoever, any at all, throw it out. It is not worth it. There's a basic rule in food microbiology of when in doubt, throw it out. So, uh, your, your health is more important than a can of beans. As long as there's no uh, bulging of the can and there's no dents on the, the, the three seams of the can, then you're okay. If I'm in the grocery store and I drop the can of beans on the floor and I can see there's a dent on the seam, I can take that home and eat it within the next two, three days, but not more than that. Okay. I'm, I'm glad that we're having this discussion because this never even crossed my mind in the past. It didn't bother me to take a, a dented can and use it. It just, um, and most of the time it's in the side and probably yeah. not on the seam. Right. But and I've if, never looked if seam, that if, closely. Yeah. If the seam is intact, you're okay. Um, okay. Look carefully at the seam. And for example, if this thing is bending over, you know, because it's, you got a big dent on it and this the whole thing is being stressed, well, recognize it's being stressed. Um, that particular can probably needs to be used up sooner than later. And if it's been sitting on the shelf for who knows how long, is there really any way to know or should it just be tossed? You puncture it when you're opening the can. Listen, is, can you hear a exchange of air? Is there a good vacuum in there? If there's a good vacuum, it's a lower risk. But um, my humble thought is if if there's any reason whatsoever that that you think it might be in a dangerous thing, just don't mess with it. It's a single can, throw it away. Now, another question that I've had recently, because there's a lot more of these pull top lids uh, right. than there used to be. And I guess I've wondered if they are as safe as a regular can that you're going to open with a can opener, uh, or if that potential is there as well, 
on those pull tops to to separate a little bit. I got to say, it's the same principle. Um, is it intact? If it's intact, it's fine. Treat it like a seam. And if there's a, you can have a seam that's damaged, that doesn't leak. Uh, just recognize that again, during the denting of the seam, it can do this very quickly and allow a bacteria or something to get in without losing any product. Treat, treat it like any other seam. All right. So in general, then these pull tops, there's not a serious issue. That that was something that came up and um, I wondered, but it sounds like as long as it's intact and not dented, we're good. You're good. Joe, thank you so, so much for coming and teaching us again. We really <laughs> appreciate this. Glad and help. now for the question of the day, what question do you have for our food scientist about storing food and how to be safe? Comment below. And thanks for being mm -hmm. part of the solution. <laughs>